titles tend toward prideful self-preaching. It appears there has been a steady increase of men and women who are in a church position applying titles to themselves, apostle, reverend, prophet, etc. There is along with the use of titles an apparent perception that the titles mean they are closer to God and above others. There is the effort of title holders to convince self and others for their worthiness because of their title to have a seat higher in the congregation, placed in higher places. Title use often accompanies the honoring of the Lord Jesus being left greatly lacking. Uplifting of the Lord Jesus is so desperately missing in the midst of title-bearing church leaders. It is to me very evident that Satan seeking a higher seat also had a title he used in his deception. As soon as there is a change in the heart, there is a change in the title. Job 32, 21 through 22. Let me not, I pray you, accept any man's person, neither let me give flattering titles unto man. For I know not to give flattering titles, in so doing, my Maker would soon take me away. Esther 3, 2 and all the king's servants that were in the king's gate bowed and referred Haman, for the king had so commanded concerning him. But Mordecai bowed not, nor did him reference. Hebrews 12.28 Wherefore, we receiving a kingdom which cannot be moved, let us have grace whereby we may serve God acceptably with reverence and godly fear.